The importance of Crimea to Russia is strategic. One of Moscow's four naval fleets is based there. But it's also historic and symbolic. Once part of the Russian Empire, today an autonomous republic of Ukraine, Crimea is days away from a referendum on secession. An area around the size of Belgium, it's a peninsula on the Black Sea coast. To the east, it almost touches neighboring Russia, which many Crimeans feel closer to than Ukraine. According to the most recent census conducted in 2001, close to 60% of Crimea's population are ethnic Russians and around 22% are ethnic Ukrainians. The peninsula was ruled by the Tatars until the 18th century. After World War II, they were deported by Stalin, accused of cooperating with the Nazis. Today, an estimated 12% of Crimea's population are Tatars. Soviet leader Nikita Khrushchev gifted Crimea to Ukraine in 1954. At the time, few could imagine that the USSR would collapse decades later. When it did, Ukraine became independent with Crimea within its borders. It's estimated that more than 80% of Crimeans are Russian speakers, with 77% considering Russian their mother tongue. That's compared to around 10% who say Ukrainian is their mother tongue. In the country's last presidential election, almost 80% of Crimean voters supported Russia-leaning candidate Viktor Yanukovych. While the US and Europe have warned Vladimir Putin against moving to bring Crimea under Moscow's control, annexing the peninsula would be seen by many Russian nationalists as the return of the territory to its natural home.